Ladies and gentlemen, we're here. Freeman! The paper is here. <laughs> Today is night time. Today, I need to <laughs> tell a scary story. <laughs> this story. <laughs> It's about this guy named Aiden Green. Now, Aiden Green was a a young fellow, a 15-year-old fellow, back in 1968. 15-year-old working at a circus as a clown. Now this guy has gotten fired from his job. So, one day he just decided, I'm tired of this shit. He stopped believing. He just stopped believing in everything that he believed in and before. Now, one day, he found this guy on the street. People still don't know his name till this day. But all we know is, he taught, pe he taught Peter, people voodoo. So this guy ate him. Say, hey, what's your name? Told him his name. He asked him, What you do for a living? Then I teach voodoo classes at my house. It's not really classes, just like an individual thing. Well, I need something to relieve my stress, says Aiden. Then God gave him, the guy gave Aiden his card. Next thing you know, he calls him up, sets up an appointment, goes to his house. Now, from there, he teaches him all about voodoo. All about voodoo. How to possess people. How to transfer yourself into something. Taught him all of that. And then, he just got too good at it. This guy, Aiden, has got too good at it. And then, he taught himself how to get himself into dreams and stuff. He started going to people's dreams. And then, he started going into little kids' dreams. Now, he will, this is what he will say. He will go into kids' dreams and give kids advice. This is how he will approach the kid. Hi, what's your name? The kid will say his name. And people, and he say, people call me tips. Because I'll give you tips, advice about stuff that you need to know. He gave this one kid advice. His name was Felix. And he just kept coming back, coming back, coming back. He gave this kid bad advice. 
kid got suspended from school. He's being held in a mental facility for something that is completely real. Now, Ada Green kept coming back, coming back, coming back, and this one day, Philly just decided he getting tired of this guy. Why does this guy keep harassing me? Why? Why is he harassing me? Then, he told Ada Green, I'm tired of you. Coming to my dream, giving me bad advice. I'm in a mental hospital, for fuck's sake. And, Aiden Green just kept coming face to face with him in his dreams. And then, he started to come in real life, approaching him in a mental facility. He started getting paranoid. Start getting freaking out. Freaking out, man. He was freaking out. Now. One day. Felix was cured for some day. He wasn't supposed to be cured for. Then, Andy Green approached him during school. He told him to throw some at his teacher. He was like, no. And, like, you better do it, kid. Then he got up, yelled, and screamed, I'm tired of you, Mr. Green. Then the teacher's like, who are you talking to? I'm talking to Mr. Green, said Felix. He was like, talking to Mr. Green, Aiden Green. Aiden Green. Now. So, this kid. Got chased by Aiden Green. He was chased for blocks and blocks and blocks until the county sheriff called up with him and said, Let go of that boy. And it was be like, Who are you? I'm the county sheriff, you son of a bitch. Then, Andy Green fought the sheriff. He won. Then, pulled out a knife. Stuck into Felix's neck. And he said, three times, dreams do come true. Dreams do come true. Dreams do come true. Cause dreams do come true.